to the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Just one more prayer point and then we'll begin to minister. I'd like you to say, Lord, grace to not doubt you tonight. Please lift your voice and pray. Don't be a doubter. Lord, I believe in you. Lord, I believe in you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let me add one more prayer point in our lives. I'd like you to pray and say, Lord, whatever must come upon my life for me to move forward. Hold on. Let it come. And whatever must leave me, I have no loyalty to you. I don't care where you came from. Tonight I part ways with you forever. Lift your voice and pray. anointing that must land upon my life today. Every grace, every spirit, every dimension tonight you must come upon my life and everything that must leave me. I'm tired of any luggage upon my destiny. Koinoni, are you praying? Those online, make sure you are praying. Right where you are, at your home, so wherever you are streaming from. Hallelujah. 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 One of the graces I'm trusting God to come upon our life is grace for accelerated advancement. Listen, listen. There are many of us, our pace of movement is slow. You can't look at your life and say, A, B, C has happened within this time. It's not a good testimony. I'd like you to pray and say, Lord, I must move. Oh, I must move. There must be advancement. The overflows. Make sure you are praying. God is sharing you where you are. Yes, oh God, I'm parting ways forever.
Alléluia. 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 Listen. Listen. You must contend with prophecy. Oh, this bad luck upon my life must leave. I was not cursed like that. Even if it's a curse, it must go. Are you hearing what I'm saying? It's a war unto them who are these in Zion. There is enough function tonight to deliver the result you desire, except you are not interested. If you truly are interested and you are angry enough, tonight is not the time to spectate and pinch and gist. Anybody does that kind of thing for you tonight, know that the spirit is using that person. You can't come here and waste your time. Hallelujah. I'm about to pray for you. I'm about to speak. Please, I want you to pray. Mention every negative thing that you know has happened, patterns in your life that you know must change and say, God, arise for me tonight. Lift your voice and pray. Lord, it must go over my family. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now listen. 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 Before God deals with our lives, we are going to be praying first and foremost that God will deal with our families. See, let me tell you something. It's not your fault that you came from that family. But it's your fault if you allow what came from there to destroy you. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Believe what I'm saying, oh Koinonia. Believe what I'm saying. I love you too much to not lie to you. There are, there are ties and strongholds that are stopping people from rising. Lift your hands, everybody. Every high thing must come down. Every stronghold shall be broken. You wear the victor's crown. You overcome. You overcome. Every high thing must come down. You wear the victor's crown. You overcome. Every high thing must come down. I want to pray. Now listen. Don't get too used to the fact that it's just about speaking and then people fall under the anointing and come be serious while prayers are going. Because it is at the word of God they respond. They are listening to me. I'm speaking. But until the command is given, there is nothing to confirm. I want to pray. Many of you will be very surprised. Open up your spirit. It's time for God to visit you and visit your families. Hallelujah. Lift your hands, please. My God. God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm seeing in the realm of the spirit pointed arrows. Listen. Pointed arrows. Pointed arrows. And on those arrows, I see like papers placed on the arrows containing the names of people names of families names of territories that's what the Lord is showing me right now and we're going to pray Listen, the power of God is going to come very strongly upon people it's, it's not just you but your family are we together and once that happens know that the time has come you pray it and declare that deliverance Lift your hands. I want to pray now. Father, you brought us here to change lives, change testimonies.
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God is giving me a very crazy instruction. Just lift your left hand. Be stupid. I've started my stupidity. Just follow me quietly. Just lift your left hand up to God and let me do the speaking. You don't have to say anything. Please, all those who I'm going to speak to now that the power of God comes on them, let's begin to have them outside. Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray right now. My God, I'm seeing so many people. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just responding to the Spirit. Lord, you ask us to lift our left hands up. Whatever that means. There are people. I see fire right now. It's going to begin to come on people. Lord, the moment that comes on their family, let there be massive deliverances. At the count of four, that will happen now. One, two, three, four. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out right now. Inside, outside. I'm seeing the spirit of God. There's fire moving to families. Please, let's save time. At the word of the Lord, I place the word of the Lord upon that situation of witchcraft inside outside is over is over is over is over i come with a word of prophecy i prophesy as i've been commanded miracles deliverances for families enough is enough oh god bring them there are so many people outside so many people outside all the overflows i see miracles it's like fire it's like fire hallelujah keep your hands down i'm seeing fire and it's going to come upon the heads of people and the lord is saying it is still the deliverance lord where are they where are they where are they Right now, all over the congregation, I prophesy it like fire. I see like an eruption, a volcanic eruption coming on the heads of people. The heads of people. Shake it, take it out. Where you are, the fire will meet you there. Where you are, where you are. The enemy has done this. We command every havoc. We command every havoc. I tell you, I see deliverance for many families. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. I command every spirit. Causing the tragedies. In my family. Be exposed now. Lift your voice and pray. Lift your voice and pray. The light shines in the darkness. The light shines in the darkness. As you are praying, the power of God will come upon you. As you are praying, the power of God will come upon you. Be exposed. The spirits eating up finances, eating up joy, eating up peace. Kapatatata, ekerato soto basiata. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. I see written on this pulpit altars. And I want to pray. An altar is a platform erected by men that grants access to spiritual operations. Altars. 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 At the count of seven, I tell you, many people 
This is not just families now. One, two, three, four. Get ready. Five, six, seven. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Altars. Catch fire. Altars. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Shake it, take it, poro sotoba. Lift your hands, everybody. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. The Lord is asking me to call situations. The moment I call them, all those who are victims of it, the power of God will come upon them. Please, we are going to be fast. Right now, I pray the spirit of failure upon people. I'm seeing it. Lord, wherever they are right now, at the count of three, let there be an exposition. One, two, three. Go, go, go. Failure, failure, failure. Causing failure in lives. Failure in destinies. Failure in ministries. Failure in business. Failure in academics. Every form of failure. Fire is coming on it right now. Fire is coming on it right now. Inside, outside. No, you can't stand it. It's your deliverance. It's your word. It's your prophecy. It's your word. That's why you came. Failure. Lift your hands, everybody. I'm seeing chains. And the Lord is saying, let delay leave my people. That's what I'm hearing. Lord, where are those whose lives have been under one spot? Inside and outside. At the count of three, I like you to shout, Jesus, delay is leaving now. One, two, three. Go, 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 go. Delay, delay, delay of all kinds, of all kinds. Parato Soto Peketesh. Delay. Delay. All kinds of delay. All kinds of delay. All kinds of delay. Be broken now. Now. Let her go in the name of Jesus. Let her go. I break that chain now. 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 That chain of delay. That chain of delay is broken over your life in the name of Jesus Christ. God is breaking delay. Listen. Hallelujah. I've prayed this prayer in this place before. And the Lord is asking me to pray it again. That the destinies of men can be exchanged. So that you are walking. But you are not living your destiny. It's like you are living another person's life. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Please take this prayer seriously. It will do wonders in your life. Lift your hands. Inside and outside. And you watch what will happen now. Lord I pray. My God. I'm telling you, all I'm seeing in this place is fire. Any man here, any woman whose destiny has been exchanged so that the life you are living is not your blueprint right now. 
let the exchange let there be another exchange another exchange another exchange the power of god is coming on people right now right now right now release your destiny release that mother's destiny now release that mother's destiny now my goodness it's your destiny it's your destiny you can't leave another person's script every witchcraft every manipulation i cause it now i cause it now i cause it now hallelujah hallelujah the lord is asking me to pray for people with strange movements in their body i tell you i feel fire it's like people are literally bathing in fire strange movements i want to pray there are many ladies many mothers under this category right now in the name of jesus i stretch my hands every stranger there is a lady you feel a physical snake physical snake moving on your body but right now in jesus name at the count of three fire from the throne fire from the throne i command those spirits roaming around the bodies of god's people one two three go 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 now leave their bodies strange objects strange objects strange objects strange objects hallelujah hallelujah please sisters lift your hands i want to pray a very powerful prayer for our sisters the devil will prefer to get one woman to ten men because a woman is a gate in the realm of the spirit i tell you no power will stand something is about to jump out of somebody's life ah, yeah, yeah. break every chain break every chain break every chain yeah. break every chain let her go right now your destiny must open up in the name of jesus christ break every chain Lift your hands, sisters. There are many ladies here under several oppressions. That's why many things are not working. But sisters, as surely as the Lord lives, at the count of three, I'd like you to shout Jesus. You will be surprised to see what will happen to you. Are you ready? One, two, three. Deliverance for you right now. Deliverance. Help them, my goodness. Please help them. Gates. 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 Be broken. Gates. Be broken. Kapataya. Gates. Be broken. Gates. Be broken. Gates. Be broken. I'm praying it again. Lift your hands. Ay, ay, ay. Every devil that came here with you must let you go. Lift your hands. There are sisters. There is already a programming on your destiny to fail. A programming to be barren. Who is this God that can look into time? Wherever they are, at the count of three, may the power of God fish them out. One, two, three. Take that fire. Take that fire. Take that fire. I open your destiny. Every lady, every sister, you are a gate. You are a gate in the realm of the spirit.
it. Mighty deliverance. Mighty breakthrough. Mighty breakthrough. Mighty breakthrough. It's over. It's over. It's over. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Over. 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 Break every chain. Break every chain. Yeah. Break every chain. Hallelujah. Now I want to pray for the brothers. Lift your hands. Listen, let me tell you. There is a spirit that makes men not to be productive. Hear me. It's a, it's, it's a mighty deliverance that will happen to many men right now. Pay attention. There are men who are just going old. There's nothing happening in their lives. It's not your fault. There are keys that have been withheld from you. But that thief must be exposed. Lift your hands. I want to pray. Ancestry. That's the first thing we are dealing with the brothers. Brothers, lift your hands. I want to pray. Many of you will be surprised to see what happens. Every spirit of ancestry. Every spirit of inheritance. Over any brother here. Stopping his advancement at the count of three. Some of you will be very surprised. That fire will come on you. Are you ready now? One, two, three. Take it. Take it. Take it. That fire. Help them, please. Help them. My goodness. Kaparata kata. Brothers are coming under this unction. It's time to move forward. It's time to move forward. Help them. I cast that spirit. I cast that spirit. I cast that spirit. Hallelujah. God does this all the time. And I don't know why God is doing this again. <laughs> ah. If he did it before, he can do it again. Sing. Listen, I see something strange happening. Strange happening. Strange happening in the spirit. And I'm seeing the spirit of the Lord moving. And God is saying he's visiting Eastern Ants. Eastern and evil people. That's what I'm seeing. There are altars that need to be broken. Please pay attention. I'm about to pray right now. Wherever they are, always he will do it. You are from the east. Get set. Be sensitive. Come on. You shouldn't be doing that. Eastern and Lord, wherever they are, it will come like fire on you. You will be surprised. To see what will happen to you now. The spirit of God goes to the east. The spirit of God goes to the east. And is bringing deliverance. Deliverance. Strange deliverance. Evil people. Strange deliverance. By the power of the Holy Ghost. He's visiting your soil. Visiting your foundation. Visiting your soil. If it did it before. He can do it again. Same God back then. Same God right now. If he did it before, Abia, 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 Abia said, Shaka Tabarata, Abia, Abia, the Spirit of God 
is moving across Apia. Miracles. Breaking foundations. If he did it before, he can do it again. Same God back then. Hallelujah. Many of you wonder why God does these things. There are signs and wonders. He steps into, you will see the testimonies that will come from this thing. Strange visitation. Lift your hands, everybody. Joshua Selman. God be pleased. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. I'm walking in the spirit and I see a map. And the Lord is asking me to jump upon it. And I see Kaduna. Southern Kaduna. That's what I see. Right now, Lord, at your word, move. Southern Kaduna. Visiting men and women. That's what the spirit of God is saying. I speak it. I place the word of God upon it. Lord, go to that region right now. Southern Kaduna. Southern Kaduna from Saminaka to Zonkua. Everywhere. Move. Let the power of God touch people. Liberty for territories. Liberty for territories. No matter where you are, I'm telling you, Southern Kaduna, fire is falling. Fire is falling upon your soil upon your soil southern kaduna southern kaduna that's what i see southern kaduna connected to southern kaduna there is a miracle happening altars in southern kaduna i come against you by this apostolic and prophetic mantle leave god's people now of the spirit I found it working in my life is powerful God just calls a territory and everyone is like a digital spiritual system it's not something you just do by guesswork it's the spirit of God the spirit of God the spirit of God God is still touching Kaduna people I'm still hearing it in my spirit God is still touching Kaduna people there's no escape any family tied to any altar comes under fire. Any Kaduna family married to Kaduna living in Kaduna state. hallelujah please lift your hands while still pray I want to pray for students now something miraculous will happen here now I want to pray for students because I see conspiracy to short circuit people's performances I'm going to pray but there is a God in heaven with an all-seeing eye. And there is an unction he can release. I'm going to pray. Listen, let me tell you. You will be surprised to hear the testimonies that will come. The way God is working this night is very supernatural. If the power of God comes upon you, I want you to know that an angel is doing something over your result. Just hear what I'm saying. Hear what I'm saying. I'm speaking by the Spirit. Father, 
There are people whose results need to be worked upon divinely. And where are they? I see almost 45 people. Right now at the count of three. One. Results. Two. Three. Let the angels begin to move. As they move, it will affect you. As the power of God touches you, your result is being worked upon by the power of the Holy Ghost inside and outside. Results, results. Carry over us. Receiving the mercy of God. Receiving the mercy of God. God upgrading CGPS. Upgrading CGPS. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. CGPS. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Supernaturally. By the creative power of prophecy. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Everything that has refused to let you smile. Hear me. That joy and laughter will not come out of your mouth. I stand tonight in the name of Jesus. I bring that thing under fire. Amen. I bring it under fire. Amen. I bring it under fire. Shake ta ta ta. I bring it under fire. Yeah. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Just lift your hands and be silent if you can. A miracle is happening. A miracle is happening. This is what I'm seeing. I'm seeing letters in the spirit. And these are employment letters. Hold on. Just keep your hand. Just do what I'm asking you to do. You will be surprised. Many of you for you and for your loved ones. The Lord is just asking. Just lift your hand. Father, at least 17 people. Inside, outside, there are up to five people online. Supernatural jobs. May the angels of breakthrough take this word to the people right now. Right now, right now. Right now, receive it. Receive those letters in the spirit. Receive it in the spirit. Receive it in the spirit. Receive it in the spirit. For you, for your loved ones. I don't care what they read. I don't care what they have. We give them jobs. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I see at least four people. Three of them are ladies in the congregation. Your mothers are due for promotion. But they've done everything they know to do. As I'm speaking right now. An anointing will come upon you. To signify what he's doing to them. Lord go ahead. Locate them. Promotion. I force it. I force it now. I force that promotion. Take it. Carry it for your mothers. Whoever is sitting on their promotion. Whoever is sitting on their promotion. The judgment of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're going to pray for the sick. But. Um, there are two women I want to pray for here. You are trusting God for the fruit of the womb. Now I know there are many people. Listen. There are two women particularly. One of them the anointing. Of, please no standing for wife. No standing for anybody. If you are not the person. Um, sit down. If you are not married, don't come here. Praise God. Please. The two women by themselves, I'm going to pray. 
that lady, oh, let me, let me, let me pray for her. That devil, let her go. Don't disturb us, don't waste our time. Out! Out now! Out in the name of Jesus, I curse you by the God of heaven. In the name of Jesus, you are living, release her family, release her destiny right now. You're a noise maker, out you go and don't waste our time in Jesus' name. I set her free in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, please listen, we're going to pray for those two women. I don't know if there are here, the two of them here, there's one of them, um, I'm seeing one of them, the anointing of the spirit is going to come upon her. I don't know who that person is, but there's one, please, we have such people, we have to be fast. If I mention your case, once we give you one minute, there's no response, we have to move so that God can help us, please. Except if they are outside there, then that's all right. A married woman that need the fruit of the womb, we have to pray for them right now. Praise the Lord. How many of us are trusting God for healing miracles in our bodies? Let me see your hands. I know many of our mothers are in this category. No matter what the case is, who is stand up? Come on down. The power of God will come upon that person. Please make sure they are married though. Please stand up, stand up, madam. It's okay. Uh, madam, madam, it's okay. Please. Madam, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. How many years have you been married? 20 years. 20 years. No child. Look at me. Madam, look at me. Look at me. It's okay. 20 years of marriage. If if that woman gave birth to a child by now, that's the other person, right? Wariness. Why am I seeing her? I'm seeing chains around her stomach. You must remove it now. Remove it now. You are a devil of darkness. You hear my voice. Take off that chains now. In the name of Jesus Christ. There's no such thing as barrenness. It's nonsense. When a spirit sits on your stomach, there's no way a child will come. If you like, do whatever. You go to India and come back. You only waste money. But there is a God. Madam, please look at me. I want to pray for you. Are you here with your husband? You came here for program. I'm a student here. And you decided to. Where is your husband? He's in Kafancha. We okay. reside in Kafancha. Okay, look at me, madam. Do you believe God can give you a child? I believe that's why I came. Believe that's why I came. It's okay, it's okay, madam. Look at me. Look at me, madam. Place your hand on your stomach. I want to pray. How many of us believe this woman will come and stand and testify? If you are doubting this, you've not been in Koinonia. Madam, look at me. I want you to shout as loud as you can, I receive. Just shout it. I Is God, ba? let me tell you that is that is not working in your life does not mean it's not available. I've told you this thing. You have to believe there are dimensions in God. This woman you see will come and stand here with her child. Why is she here, madam? Why are you here? You are married for how many years? Give her the mic. How many years? Ten years. The anointing is on you. Lay your hands on your stomach. Look at me, madam. Shout, I receive, if you believe. I receive. <laughs> There's something leaving your body now. Let it go. You are a devil. Let her go right now. 
Something is coming out of your stomach. That's what I'm saying. That's what has stopped your barrenness. Go and have your child. In the name of Jesus. Go and have your child. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please let me pray. Madam, make sure you people return with your testimonies. You want to pray. Is your husband here? Husband, please come, sir. I want to pray for you. Marriage is between two people, not three people. I look in the spirit and I'm seeing three people. Somebody is a stranger in this equation. Please come, sir. I'm seeing a third person in the spirit refusing to let this marriage work. I'm seeing a third person in the realm of the spirit refusing to let this marriage work. The devil is a liar. We are going to pray. Please hold your hands together. Just in one of your hands. Yes, I want to pray. Please put your hand this one. Watch what happens to you. <sighs> there is a name, oh. There is a name. There is a name. Lift them. Lift them. Lift them. Lift them. Lift them. There is a name. Let her go. Strangers, Kabataya. What God has joined together and prophesied. That's why I said, hold your hands. Anybody whose hand is not held physically should not be in this equation. Therefore, I prophesy. Any stranger, release what you are putting in a stomach now. I'm seeing a snake. That's what I see in the spirit. I'm looking and I'm seeing a serpent. In the name of Jesus, release her now. Release her now. Kaparatakaya. Marriage was done legally. Therefore, you are an illegal occupant. Release her now. Let there be miracle children. Miracle children. I'm seeing a lady in the crowd. You are standing in for your sister who has been married for five years. Who is that? I want to pray for that person. Five years. Your sister has been married five years. No child. No child. You are the one. Where is she? What's her name? Deborah. Where is she? She's in Kenya. How many years? Five years. No child. No child. My brother, six years. And you, the devil, wants to give you four years. I will cancel it. Destiny changer. You are the destiny changer. Will you come and change my destiny? My destiny today. Come and change my destiny. My destiny today. Destiny changer, you are a destiny changer. Oh, I change my destiny, my destiny hold on. today. Please don't just come out at will. What's it? Hold on, hold on. Coordinate yourself. Who is this? Hold on, hold on. Leave them, leave them. It's okay. Victor, leave her. It's okay. Calm down. How many years? Huh? Nine years. Where is she? She's in other embouchi. Kiki Amata. That is how we embu. Amen. Why are you here, my dear? She has been coming with scourges. For how many years? Yes. Three years. Mm. <laughs> Her husband wants a boy, she wants a girl. Who will win? Did you hear what I said? I said her husband wants a boy, she wants a girl. Who will win? The man is the head of the family. See, this thing is being done by an anointing. It's not, it's not, it's not joke. It's an anointing. Look at me. Listen, every lady, place your hand on your womb. I want to pray for you. Just, just place your hand and leave it there. Hold on. Not, not for the brothers. Brothers, you don't have a womb. Just calm down. I know I'm praying for the sisters. That's why I'm praying. Because you see, listen. <laughs> just follow what I'm doing. You will be surprised to see what will happen. The Bible, the Bible does not allow you to test whether you are pregnant first before you marry. Is that true? So there is no way you know. You just marry 
and then find out it's a disaster for a man, a family to pay the price, pay dowry and get married and then there's that nonsense. So lay your hands. I want to pray for you. Let's attack it in advance. If you care for the prayer, lay your hands. For some of you, God is saving you years of misery. I'm seeing a number 21 and this is at least 21 people and families involved. Father, visit them now. Visit them now. Visit them now. I'm praying a miracle is happening to your womb. Visit them now. Visit them now. Visit them now. Right now, everything that wants to plant barrenness in your stomach, for every lady here and those watching online, I command it to leave you right now in the name of Jesus. I command it to leave you right now in the name of Jesus. My dear, look at me. Hold that baby. You, Ejimi, please give her that child. Just hold her so she doesn't fall. Just hold that baby. You are holding this child as a prophetic symbolism for your sister, for you when you get married, and for every other person, and for two other people who are in the congregation. This prophecy is connecting them. Where are they, oh God? Where are they, oh God? The anointing of the Spirit will locate them now. Right now, two of them in the congregation for this miracle. For this miracle. For this miracle. Daddy, sir, please let me talk to you. Just give a few minutes. You and the madam close to you. Mommy, please come. You are an usher, but you are praying. Come, let God answer your prayers. This lady is talking to the Lord. What was the issue? It's my sister. You are asking the Lord to do what? Bless her. She has put to bed in time, but none of them is alive. Because I'm seeing a spirit. As soon as she's giving birth, this is like an antelope. It eats the children. As in, it's the child sometimes most of the children will grow nine months you give birth then they will last for only a few minutes and they will die hold my hands where is she don't, don't cry don't cry where is she what's her name laddie 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 will speak to you lay your hand on your stomach Lord, in the name of Jesus, we declare that this, this, this frustration is over. In the name of Jesus Christ. That is, I want to pray for you. Mama, good evening, ma. Please, please stand up. Who is the stubborn child that you want God to touch? Lift his picture up. Victor, Victor, Victor. This is your number one prayer. The one you want to marry. Where is the person? The one you want a job for that graduated. Job, job. The one that graduated. The graduates. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Henry. Henry. Mama, yes, sir. this is to tell you that God knows your situation. I hear what I'm saying. Yes, sir. This boy needs to be prayed for. So that this boy, so that they will not go and lock him in police station. Yeah? This, I don't know who the boy is, but... Let it stop on, sir. That's what I'm saying, madam. It's okay. You are here for God to visit you. Amen. Amen. Who is Nonso? Nonso. Nonso. I'm hearing the name Nonso. We are going to pray. Nonso. Mama, we are going to pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Eh? Very soon. Solomon, he want to marry. He's he planning for his wedding, sir. Okay, it's alright. We'll, we'll pray for him. In the name of Jesus Christ, Mama, I pray for you. You came here expecting the power of God to touch you. Exactly. Huh? Yes, sir. Mama, do you want the pain in your body to stop? Yes, sir. You wake yes, up in the Lord. morning and there's severe pain yes, in your Lord. back. Sir, you know about this thing. I know, sir. And the Lord is going to do a great miracle for Mama. Amen. 
because mama i'm seeing you you can't wash for long you bend down to wash and your back is pain thank you father in the name of jesus christ the lord who has seen you is going to do a miracle for you i command by the power of the holy spirit help mama in jesus name thank you Please, don't. who is this? Eh? No, so, my friend, are you not so? Help the boy, his trouser is removing. Who is that? Who brought him out? Maybe we should help him now. <laughs> Sir, I want to pray for you. I want to pray for you. What do you do, sir? I'm the proprietor of his school. Pastor, I'm a civil engineer by training. You own a school? Yes, sir. Primary school? Nursery and primary. Nursery and primary? Yes, sir. You've been afraid to start the secondary school? Seriously, sir. Is that true? I've been afraid. Because what is happening in the primary, up and down, up and down, people are taking their children out of your school. And they're owing money. And they're owing money. And you are trusting God for a miracle. Because you too, you need a lot of money now. As you are standing here like this, you need money. Very correct, sir. And this money is much. Don't collect loan. Don't collect loan. Loan is a way to die. Don't collect loan. Sir, I want to pray for you. One of the things you are going to start seeing as you minister the word is breakthrough. You will start seeing strange breakthrough. Amen. In the lives of people. Amen. And then we want to pray for your school, sir. Things are going down. Yes. What you need is not money. What you need is very qualified teachers who are really willing to teach. Because the people there, they will come today, a few months, they want to leave. Yes. And when they, you know, they want... I will have to pray for you. The devil is a liar. Please lift your hands, sir. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Let the anointing for speed come upon you, sir. Supernatural speed. In the name of Jesus Christ. Grace and speed for you. Mama, God bless you. Please, who is this? Please, if we have not called your case, just be patient. We are going to pray for the sick now. Why is Mama here? Mommy, please come. Huh? Your son's name is Nonso. What's your name? Nonso. From where? When I'm from state. You are a student here? No. Dark. Who is Shidi? I'm hearing the name Shidi. 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 Let me pray for the person now. Mama, I'm going to pray for you. Uh, what you need, this one is not, I'm not even getting any word for your son or so. What God is saying, I should prophesy to you, is that he's bringing restoration to your life. God is saying, I should tell you, you see that song that I sang at the beginning of the meeting? Yes, we are I'm speaking how, sir, it's finished. That's what God is saying, I should tell you, that he's going to bring restoration to your life. Supernatural restoration right now, by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hold my hands. Honestly, I'm not getting any prophetic word for you. But in the name of Jesus, may God step in and do a miracle for you. Come, come and get in something. You need to pray. Huh? You need academic breakthrough. Receive that grace in Jesus' name. Please, why are these people here? Huh? John. You are serving in prison. Have you started serving? Yes. In a place where? Father, give him favor. As you go, let there be favor in Jesus' name. Amen. You are what? John. John. From where? Zaria. I said, Sam, Father John. But since you have come out, let me pray for you. Huh? Lay your hands on your chest. You love God? Hi. John. John, look at me. God can give you a new beginning. You hear what I'm saying? It's when I make altar call, John, run and join them. Huh? I'm going to pray for you, but that statement you made is not true. Oh God, help John. In the 
in the name of Jesus Christ. Because you see, you have to be serious with God. Oh God, help John. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray. She's older than she actually is. Huh? And there is a there is there is a medical condition. This is a feminine thing that I'm seeing that is responsible for this. Um can I help, sir? Yeah? Yes, sir. Okay, Turen Shima, you, you understand English? I'm seeing happy birthday on top of you, and I'm seeing 50 years. How old are you? Shakaran Kina. I born me on 66. 66. 1966. How old is that? This woman is 50, but she's looking like 70. The devil is a liar. Huh? I'm seeing something. It's not something I can say in the open, but you need to be healed. And this thing started happening to you since soon you were about 17 years. Abone Afara Miki. Yes. Sir. About 17 years this thing started. This is a serious woman issue. This is women talk. Father, we cancel this nonsense. In the name of Jesus Christ, it must live in Jesus' name. Beginning from today, experience the goodness of God in Jesus' name. May the Lord favor you too in Jesus' name. We want to pray for the sick now. This, this is our miracle service. Bear with us. We have to deal with these things. You see that there are so many, there are so many situations. We are praying. Everyone, you can be seated if you can or stand. We are soon going to be done. But I want us to pray. Are we together? Say after me, inside and outside, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Please say it like you are serious. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare, I declare that every closed gate standing before my destiny under this corporate anointing swing open now lift your voice and begin to pray please we are not just whiling away time pray participate in the prayer some of us that's what is that's what is affecting our lives every gate every gate every gate every gate every gate Finances over the period of my life. Be open now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Prayer point number two. I will still prophesy it upon your life. Say in the name of Jesus, I call forth by the power of prayer every helper who will give me access to resources, to opportunities, and to new levels. I call them into my destiny. Lift your voice and pray. This is a powerful prayer. It's a very powerful prayer. Hallelujah. 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 I'd like you to prophesy and say in the name of Jesus. Shout it in the name of Jesus. As I enter these ember months, I declare that the mystery of divine preservation is upon my life. No death, no accident, no bad news. Lift your voice and cancel bad news. Make sure you are praying. Some of you are just looking. Pray. It's a very serious prayer point. No bad news. 
I speak upon my life the mystery of divine exemption Outside, outside, don't be tired. You're working out your salvation with fear and trembling. Before we pray on the request, I'd like you to pray and say, In the name of Jesus, how about now? Let's be serious. In the name of Jesus, In the name of Jesus. September, September, October, October November, November, December. Hear my voice. I speak to you. Deliver to my life. Only blessings. No pain. No sorrow. No regrets. 
Go ahead and prophesy. Release power to your future. Release power to September. You shut your mouth, you shut your destiny. Release power to September. Release power to October. Release power to November. December. No plane crash. No post crash. No armed robbery. No terrorism. Hallelujah. Say in the name of Jesus. I declare a covering over me and my family members. Wherever they are, the seal of the blood exempts them from tragedy. Listen, I shared some months ago. Hold on. I shared some months ago. A vision that the Lord showed me. I'm not one person who will stand and say, I saw this. Sometimes I see these things. I just pray. But it was upon my spirit and I said it. Remember, I spoke about the month of September. Everything you see us do here is prophetic. As you speak, it looks like you are joking. But you are releasing power to your future. He said, declares thou that he might be justified. Hast thou commanded thy morning? You don't sit down and it delivers everything to you. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Say in the name of Jesus. The seal of the blood is upon my life and my family members. Therefore, every spirit of death and loss and disaster must pass over my life and my family. Lift your voice and pray. No, not upon my life. Not upon my loved ones. They are sealed by the mystery of the blood. No accident. No accident. No death. No obituary. No plane crash. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Stretch your hands towards this prayer request and begin to turn your request to testimonies. Go ahead. All those online, follow us. We are praying. You submitted your requests and we are praying. Every request. Oh God, you have produced testimonies. Shaba katata. To the God that answers prayers. To the God that answers prayers. To the God that answers prayers. Let there be miracles, testimonies, breakthroughs. Turn around impossible situations, oh God. Let the barren come back to children. Let the poor return rich. Let the captive be set free. Let sinners come to the saving knowledge of Jesus. Let your bread be delivered. Let the sick be healed. Let jobless people return to jobs. Building projects completed. Spiritual lives be fired. Pray, pray. I'm going to prophesy upon this request and I want us to agree with a resounding amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we declare, I use this as a point of contact. Lord, there are so many requests here representing the challenges in people's lives. Some for jobs, some for marriages, some for children. Some for breakthroughs, some for study um, scholarships, others for help, others for reconciliation, others for souls. 
others for financial prosperity and breakthrough others for restoration some for deliverance others for healing lord i pray in the name that is above all names we have a covenant of answered prayers with you therefore lord arise as a mighty man and turn every prayer request to a testimony in the name of jesus Lord, we pray for all those who have sent their requests on Facebook, on Twitter, on any other platform. Lord, in the name of Jesus, give them strange visitations. Strange visitations from tonight. Strange visitations. And Lord, for every request that made it to this altar, I bow my knees to the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. And I pray, answer everyone in the name of Jesus. Turn every request to a testimony in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our time is gone. I really apologize. Let me prophesy over our lives. Do you know why prophecy is very powerful? Most of the testimonies that you hear, listen. Most of the testimonies that you hear, are as a result of these prophetic words. Are we together? There are needs that God may not reveal and time may not permit to be able to extensively deal with. However, prophecy is powerful. It says in Numbers chapter 6 how that the priest will bless them and speak upon their life. There is something about a prophetic word coming upon your life. Those who know this, that is their edge in the spirit have received it and it has produced dramatic results in their lives. Those who are careless about it like they are about many other things never really get to receive anything. Let me tell you, even if it's an impartation, even if it's a dimension of breakthrough, for as long as you stepped your feet here and for all the thousands following us online, connect, connect. Distance is no barrier in the spirit. It says you have turned my mourning into dancing and you have turned my sorrow into joy. I prophesy to you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Joy like you have never experienced from January till now. Experience it in the name of Jesus. Joy like you have never experienced. Experience it in the name of Jesus. Hear me. I speak to your hands. Whoever is not doing anything here. Because God said be fruitful. I don't care whether it's a job. A business. I don't care whether you are a student. A graduate. A retiree. Whoever is having an idle hand. Between now and September miracle service. I put something in your hand. I put something in your hand. I put something in your hand. In the name of Jesus. Not something that will mock you. Something that will bring results. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. I put pressure on your destiny helpers. I put pressure on them. May they respond to you. I put pressure on their spirits. May they arise and help you. May they arise and help you. Hallelujah. Any situation in your life that is a recurrent decimal, it comes as though the breakthrough is coming, then the situation repeats itself. I prophesy no more. No more. No more. No more. In the name of Jesus, no more. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Listen. Someone is speaking here like Mary and saying, how shall these things be? Lord, I, is it true that you will turn my life? I stand in the name of Jesus and I pray. A turn around that will surprise you. Receive it in the name of Jesus. A dramatic turn around. A dramatic turn around. Hallelujah. 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 In the last one month of my life, God has brought 
breakthroughs and things to my life that I have always believed God. But there is something God can do in your life that will make you fear Him. Not just believe Him. I prophesy to someone here. In the name that is above all names. That flight in the spirit that God can take a man and bring acceleration and not just surprise you but even make you fear. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. I pray for everyone in business here and it's no diving. Things are not happening. You turn everywhere. You've done everything you know to do. You need the prophetic. I add that prophetic dimension to your business. I add that prophetic dimension to your business. Every dream that is still on paper, no finances, no grace to bring it out of paper. You have been writing things for donkey years, but the grace to put it at work, I declare between now and next next month miracle service bring evidence bring evidence bring evidence bring results bring results in the name of Jesus anyone called jobless in this place that you have done everything to do including giving money to people and they have not brought jobs to you I don't know how God will do it but this mountain mover that can shake every mountain. I pray, may he give you not just a job, a miracle job. Miracle job. Hallelujah. Every family here that is stuck in one place, you try to rise, something brings you down. You try to rise, something brings you down. Now I prophesy to you the grace for rising. Receive it in the name of Jesus. The grace for rising. Receive it in the name of Jesus. The grace for rising. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Every embargo of bad luck upon your life. It works for others until it gets to your point And people change their mind. I declare in the name of Jesus. In a way you have never seen favor and help. May you experience that throughout the month of September. Hallelujah. A dimension of anointing. A dimension of wisdom. That you have never seen. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive wisdom in the name of Jesus. Receive wisdom in the name of Jesus. And I pray for you. Everything that needs to be broken in your life. Habits and encumbrances that tie you down. I command that today is their burial. Today is their burial. Today is their burial. Hallelujah. I want to prophesy for someone who has never stood here to testify. In the name of Jesus. Whatever has stopped you from climbing this altar to testify. I curse that spirit right now. 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 Hallelujah. Stretch your hands towards me. I want to speak to you. Everything that makes money run away from your hands. Money has a spirit. You have obeyed kingdom laws, but this thing is not just coming. You would try and labor and labor and nothing will come. These hands that are stretched towards me, as I stretch my hands back to you, by the mystery of divine supply, may you hold something you have never held in your life before. May you hold something you have never held in your life before. May you hold an amount you have never held in your life before. Hallelujah. Two more prayers and we are done. I pray for your spiritual life. Everything that is alive grows. If you are not growing spiritually, something is wrong. 
And the measure, there are two indices to measure your spiritual growth. Number one, your degree of conformity to the image of the Christ. Number two, your comprehension of the mysteries of the kingdom alongside their operation. How to make them produce consistently. I pray for you this month. As we round up this month into the next month. Keys that your hands have never held spiritually. Hold them right now in Jesus name. Keys, mysteries that you have not known. Or mysteries you have had and have not been able to handle. May God give it to you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Finally, this is the prayer that I pray for people with all my heart. He said, you shall anoint, listen, you shall anoint Aaron and his sons. Right? And then he said, you shall take some of your honor and put upon him. How do you take honor and put upon him? Honor. The spiritual mystery that turns a man to a celebrity not by walking it honor is when men have the capacity to discern and reward what you represent hallelujah i was coming from abuja today and i stopped in kaduna at a particular computer outfit just to buy to quickly buy a laptop and proceed and as soon as I stepped there, I entered, I saw all of them looking at me. They started jumping as if it was a crusade. Apostle Joshua Selman, I was so embarrassed. They ran, went and called their father, the owner of the place. Uh, they call it Micro Manor in, in, in Kaduna. You know? And they were jumping and they looked. They said, ah, we, you have been blessed by your teachings. You know, God has lifted us. You can imagine the things that have happened. And they said, which laptop are you buying? And all of that. And I looked at them. I had to just run away and go out. Because I didn't want a situation where they are doing business. They carry something that is so costly and cheap. Let me tell you, honor is more than money. Oh. Don't be deceived. Money is very finite. Honor is when men rise up to solve your problems for you. They rise up and make it their business to see you succeed. May somebody here receive that mantle. May somebody here receive that mantle. May a pastor here receive that mantle. May a businessman receive that mantle. Strange honor. Strange honor. Strange honor. Strange honor. Strange honor. Strange honor. Hallelujah. When you are minding your business and some people are talking and say, how do we bless this lady? As if they owe you. They get up and plan governmental figures discussing how to lift you. And people say, what is the big deal? There is a big deal. It's a mantle. Please, I want to pray it finally. I know, I know that our time is gone. But I want you to receive this thing. There are people here carrying it bodily. When you carry it, it speaks. See, let me tell you, the true proof of sonship is a replication of grace. A replication of grace. A replication that you are carrying something you know, the devil knows, and heaven knows that this is like an address. It will cause good things to look for you. I want to pray for you. Honor makes your life easy. Otherwise, you will suffer for anything. Everything. You are in trouble, you pay for it alone. There is a mystery of honor. And Jabez was more honorable than his brethren. I pray for you, my God. In the name of Jesus, I pray for your people in this great house. You have placed your mantle of honor upon this house and by grace upon my life. I'm praying right now. Everyone under the sound of my voice. Ay, 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 ay. In a dimension you have never seen. Or for those of you who have seen a measure of it in a higher dimension... Receive that mantle of honor. 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 Keep standing everybody. I want to make an altar call now. Please no moving around. Let's honor what God is doing. No sitting down. Just five minutes and we're done. Thank you so much for your patience. We stretched the time quite um, but I think that it's worth it. If you pay that much price and you come back with tearsome testimonies, it's a wise baguette. 
there are still people under the anointing. God is still doing things. And even after the service, God is still going to be touching people. But very quickly, I want to make a call. There are people outside all the overflows, any of them. And there are people following us online. You are saying, man of God, I heard you speak. And whilst you spoke, the Holy Spirit convicted my heart and told me it's time to make a commitment or a rededication. For some of you, this is your first time making a genuine decision for Jesus. Others, you have made that decision, but you are rededicating yourself. Wherever you are, please make your way to the front. Make sure that you do not leave this place without making that decision. God bless you. There are people coming. God bless you. God bless you. Don't be afraid. Don't be ashamed. God bless you, young and old. Clear the way for them. Please, if you are coming from outside, I want you to save time. Double up, hurry up and come. God bless you. Alana Bakasuchi Ata Alana Bakasuchi Ata Keep coming Alana Bakasuchi Ata Keep coming quickly please hold on thank you so much for coming men and women people who love god listen no matter what has happened in your life no matter what you have done i don't want you to stand here feeling guilty rebels don't come to god they run away from god so that you are here in his presence some of you are rededicating your life some of you are doing so for the first time it doesn't matter what category i want you to lift your right hand please if you are still coming join them very quickly lift your right hand and say after me very clearly you are not reciting a poem say lord jesus i love you and i believe in you that you died for me to prove your love for me and now i give my heart to you to prove my love for you I receive eternal life into my spirit. I declare that I'm above sin. I'm above Satan. I'm above the flesh. In the name of Jesus, from today, I declare that I have the life of God. I'm a child of God. My name is in the Lamb's book of life. And I am victorious. In the name of Jesus, keep your hands lifted, please. Father, thank you for these ones. You have drawn them by your wisdom. Let today be the beginning of, of great days in their lives. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray that everything they have laid at your altar will remain there and never cling to their lives again. Open them up to a new dimension of life in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, I ask that you come into the lives of every one of these precious people. In the name of Jesus use them for your glory give them tearful testimonies in the name of jesus i pray amen thank you so much for making this decision now i'd like you to follow this gentleman and the lady waving their hands they will have your details in a minute and then you dearly beloved i hope you were blessed by this message do not keep the video to yourself share to as many as you can to help them bless check our home page for more of our messages subscribe to the channel comment on it, like it. See you on our next video. Bye. Pray. Pray. Pray for your destiny. The face of development. Lord, Grant me the discipline.